Hello and welcome to Ready Player Dub. We are playing Crash Bandicoot 2 and we are on the final level. Yeah. Spaced out. Yeah. We just got the special gem. Now we can get the dark crystal and the clear gem. Now we can do this like the level it is. Yeah. Whoa. 12 lives! And it was You got this, baby, I believe. She believes I can fly. She believes I can touch the sky. She thinks about it every night and day. Something, something, something fly away. Got my checkpoint already. Seven of sixty. Mm. I don't understand what the problem is supposed to be with that. Mm. Well. I realized, I think it wants me to jump up there. Mm. Maybe use the octopus. Mm. Oh, that's what that does. Oh, I had an ooh ball. That's a good one. That's rich. Boxes. Mm. A red herring. Mm. I like how it opens that box. All right, Sarah, we are one-sixth of the way there. Mm -hmm. Oh, fucking box. See it jump? Mm -hmm. I tried jumping over him. Mm -hmm. You gotta do it faster. Luckily, this is a very fruity level. <laughs> yeah, that was tough. Important thing I forgot. Yeah. Oh. Hi. See, that's why I always take my time yeah. in that area. Mm -hmm. It's just not worth the risk.
Checkpoint! One fifth of the way. Bad. Yep. That was close. Down. Bonus, yep. Pushed up. Correct. So that was two. Let's mm -hmm. keep track of those because there's a lot of nitro here. Mm -hmm. That was two. And then six. Yeah, there's six at least. Yeah, I'm just thinking, if I miss this on the first try, I think I'm fucked. Yeah. Oh well. <laughs> <laughs> Do or die. That's okay. We're good. Yeah. I feel like the rest of this level is more of like a... Like it's not... It, like this bit is mm -hmm. not so much like, oh wow, it's really hard. It's... What do you call them when the... The herring? Red herring? Yeah, where it's like... Like I feel like right here people are probably like, oh I need to jump over like that. Um, I don't know how this is working, but I'm not complaining. <laughs> Oh, well, I, I know I can do it. I was gonna say, it. yeah. Mm -hmm. Now that you say that. <laughs> I wanna look at this. I mean, I did it once, right? Mm-hmm. I'll be able to do it again. But it's not reliable. You already know that from a path level. Correct. Yeah, I was thinking maybe I'd jump up, but I can't. Here we go again, motherfuckers. Here we go again. <laughs> uh oh. That was close. Is that nitro box broken? Uh, it's a little sideways. Good. <laughs> How did I do it? That felt like it was as good as it was gonna get. Yeah, well. Not according to the game. Fuck it. Dickheads. I stand by that this is my least favorite bit. Yeah. The, the, oh! You almost pressed, like, I don't know, it just doesn't feel. Like it's timing, it feels like it's luck. Mm -hmm. Which makes it not feel like. I don't know, as a player, I just don't feel like I have any control over this, even though I obviously do. Okay. Here we go again. What I should have done mm -hmm. 
in a self-preservation. Oh, actually, hmm. I have an idea of how to do that differently. That would make it a lot easier. Yeah. I'm gonna try something different with that one. Okay. But I was gonna say I should have just spun the top boxes at that point after I kind of lost control. Mm-hmm. Unfortunately, I'm gonna do this again. Lamo. So, do you think the people that like when they post like like a walkthrough, do you think they actually play this like 80 times? And they're like every time they're like. I can only upload the one where it looks like I literally zoom through this and people go, how the fuck can someone play like this? Mm. Do you think that? Yeah. That's what I would do. Except, you know, we do the opposite. Yeah. Alright, let's play it again. No, nah, never mind. I was gonna say maybe I could jump off on this mm -hmm. and jump to the top of those ones. Mm. I don't think I can. Almost. Hi. Hi. Sometimes I feel like, like, I didn't do it here, but like there's sometimes when I'm playing games and I'm gonna start getting this way with, with this bit if I don't start getting it. Yeah. Where it feels like I'm literally gonna rip the joystick out of the controller because I'm pushing, like, move this way! Yeah. Like I said, I'm not there yet. Got a few more doors. And I'm certain to be. I'm doing it, Sarah. Yeah. I've actually... All right, here we go, here we go. Mm -hmm. I, I'm gonna start hurting you. Do you think D-pad would help? I'm gonna start hurting you, D-pad. D is for dick. Mm. Did you know that? No, I didn't know that. So, I learned that in uh, school, mm -hmm. elementary school. Yeah. He said, P is for penis, that's good enough for me. Mm. P is for penis, that's good enough for me. Mm -hmm. Say it with me, Sarah. No. Say it. No, we need to keep our monetization. He is for vagina. That's good enough for me. He is for punt. That's good enough for me. He is for pucker. That's good enough for me. He is for pitch. That's good enough for me. P is for pee pee. Yeah. I hate these boxes. Yeah. Congratulations, whoever put those in the game. You made your game less fun. <laughs> Hope you're happy.
for sucking the joy out of this game. You should have been fired. Instead, you were hired. <laughs> Sarah? Yeah. Why didn't I win yet? Uh, because you have the box. <laughs> yeah. The problem is because I ha it's not letting me get back to that point. Mm. I I'm, I, I, now I'm going to be off my timing again. Mm. I'm gonna try something. Yeah. Holy shit! What? Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I think that's what I'm supposed to do. I think I'm supposed to actually jump to the top. Yeah. I th something tells me that I'm, I'm actually just inching beyond what the game wanted me to do. Mm -hmm. And it's like, no, that's why you're doing it wrong. I think that's what it wants me to do. Mm. I don't want to do it that way. Goodbye. Yeah. Okay. You guys didn't see it? Yeah. <laughs> my feet were like... <laughs> 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 All right. We did it. Yeah. We're gonna buy that bit. Yeah. And now we have. Ugly B. Mm. Woo boy, that almost hit your butt. Yep, I'll take that. I farted that thing away. <laughs> Be gone. Uh oh. Damn. I was I was thinking like oh maybe he doesn't get close enough. But he does. So keep going. Oh I didn't even realize I died. I, I went to go do the jump and I'm like, mm -hmm. what's the game doing? This part's gonna be tough. Especially when I do that. Sarah, are you starting to, is your heart starting to beat a little faster right now? Mm. You're like, oh my god. I've seen this before. Oh, shit. You're almost at, you're at like almost at the end of the level. Really? Yeah, I saw the nitro box. Oh, uh, that was, that sh it should have given that one to me. <gasps> Sarah, I have Oogla Ball. Okay. We're good. We are good. <laughs> Crystal, boxes, and that's your switch. 
Do yep. not oh, <laughs> die. <laughs> That probably should have killed me. Okay. Okay, time to try and try. Well, I think it's gonna. I think it might put me right into the end of the game right now. Oh, okay. And then I'll have to time trial as the bonus. We'll see what happens. All right. Bring it on! Laser powered vengeance. I would figure that I would give you the choice because there is another door. True, actually, you're right. <laughs> yes! My plan is nearly complete. And I have you, Crash Bandicoot, to thank for it. Engine, what's happening? Let's, let's do the time trial. Okay. Oh. Okay, wait. I have to do this first. Okay. I have to play the game. Now, we have we have all the gems, all the... Mm -hmm. What is it? Was diamonds? All the diamonds, yeah. all the gems. Mm -hmm. And I got a lot of lives, mm -hmm. I think. Yeah. I have like seven. Damage his jetpack to keep him from escaping. Okay. Sure thing. Oh boy. Oh no. No! Defeat Cortex before he escapes to his space station. No. It's no. a gun it situation. Whoops. Oh. And every now and then he stops. So politely for you. Run faster, hold down R2 button while running. Okay. Speed choose. We should go through every time trial. No! <laughs> you are doing that on your own if you're gonna do it. Oh my god, is it? You haven't seen the last of me, Did I literally do this in the first try? I feel like there should be more to that, but I don't know. Nope. But I got all the jams, the, the gems. The diamonds, the rubies. What happens now? I love how easy that was. But what was the whole thing with the other guy? I don't know. Maybe, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Something seems wrong. 
Maybe it'll maybe it'll be after this. Maybe. Maybe like maybe after I get out of the credits. Okay, so we're not we're not fully done with our playthrough yet, but uh, we do have the credits rolling, Sarah. What did you think of Crash Bandicoot 2? High five, because I know this is gonna get five out of five. <laughs> what did you think of it? I mean, it's I, I feel like Crash Bandicoot in general is just not my cup of tea as far as the video game goes. I'm, I was more of a person that played um, Banjo-Kazooie, um, not so much this type of game. Um, yeah, I don't know, it's just, it's just, hmm, it's not my cup of tea. And I find it really hard for me to really stay engaged when when you're playing this game. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah. From from the the player perspective, mm -hmm. like I said, if you play this game, which if you like this type of game, mm -hmm. you should. Yeah. Um, Sarah mentioned this earlier in our playthroughs, where this is a more of an old school type mm -hmm. of of game. Yeah. Um, it looks great, by the way. I, I looked back at the, the original artwork for Crash Bandicoot Warped, yeah. and I was just like, oh yeah, yeah this, this looks much better. Yeah. Um, but uh, I keep hearing noises. Um, the thing you just have to keep reminding yourself, of which I failed a number of times, is that if you do go the route of 100%ing or trying to 100% this game, just remember that you're putting yourself in the situation of playing the harder versions. You know, you're, you're, that's, that's why it's, it's going to drive you nuts. <laughs> and it, and it drove me nuts. Um, part of, part of what I think drives me nuts a lot easier. When I was a kid, I used to get frustrated the hell out of some video games. So I know like, yeah. that's just how I am with video games sometimes. Like I won't give up. Yeah. Which is part of what drives me even more nuts. Uh, and, and maybe even drives up my frustration. But um, I, it's just, I don't know. It, it's, it's, it is fun. Like, it, overall, it's a fun game. It's a rare game where the bosses, at least in this round, the bosses were much easier than the actual levels. Yeah. I don't know if I just buckled down and got just no the, the bosses were fairly easy yeah yeah i feel like the bosses in the last game were a lot more challenging yeah but yeah um uh, again i know i i cussed this game out i have grievances with the game like i said i hate those steel boxes mm -hmm. but as we learned on that last level I might have been playing those bits wrong. Eh. I mean, there was still one bit in one of the ruins where it was, you had no other way other than yeah. doing your... I, I was trying to remember if I did or not. But but yeah, it, it's a game that will drive you nuts, but it it's... Overall, the I feel like this is kind of the one of those like replayable type of games. I enjoy the time trials. I enjoy the the idea of speed running and actually getting stuff for it. Mm -hmm. um, and then at the end, there it rewards you the the running option, yeah. which which again adds to its replayability. <laughs> um, with you know, oh cool, because I, I remember looking at some of these and I'm like, how in the fuck did somebody do? one of the levels that fast. I mean, it's impossible. Mm -hmm. Well, that's is why. Yeah. You get the running shoes. Mm -hmm. um, so, yeah. No, I... I again, I, I, I... This franchise, specifically the third game, of which we're going to eventually get to, um, was a, just a massive part of my childhood and it was just that game it wasn't it wasn't all the racing games and all the other stuff it was just crash bandicoot warped mm -hmm. and i replayed the hell out of that game um i really really liked it yeah so yeah we'll see i i can't wait to get to that one because that's the one where where i feel like 
is going to be kind of a, a true telling of where I am now versus where I was. Mm -hmm. Because like, I, and I know that that muscle memory and whatnot of, of replaying those matches when I was a kid. Um, mm -hmm. You know, I, I we'll see. We'll we'll see. I I'm hoping that I enjoy it as much as I did as a kid. Yeah. So. Yeah, I'm still puzzled by the ending of this video game. Maybe, I, if maybe. that if that really is the true ending to the video game, what a fucking like, <laughs> like, <laughs> I just I don't know. Like there was the whole thing with the other guy that wanted the other crystals, and he was gonna thwart the dude, man, and then like. That was like the last boss battle of the game. Yeah. And it wasn't fucking hard at all. Yeah. We'll just have to see. We'll just have to see. It's possible I just, that- I love the transition of you're in space and you just like, you know, <laughs> got his rocket for the third time and then it just immediately to crash sleeping on the beach and his sister being like, Huh, I wonder what happened with all those things that we were just at. <laughs> Weird, huh? It almost seems like it's really unresolved and you're gonna have to play the third game to actually understand. We're not gonna give you anything at the end of this video game. <laughs> it is. <laughs> it's like the end of a, it, it feels more like the end of a, an episode. Yeah. Catch them next time on Crash <laughs> it's like, Bandicoot. It's, it's like if like for um, <laughs> the I forget which season it is. The season with Tyrek in season four. Yeah, season four. Like it's almost as if you have the lead up of Tyrek and Twilight Sparkle doing their big old magical battle. But just as they are about to like do their like cool collide sort of thing, it just immediately skips to <laughs> him being dead, <laughs> and all of like Twilight and her friends are like, "Yay! The magic adventure!" <laughs> yeah. <laughs> except, except actually, it'd be more like they're about to do that. Yeah. And then it cuts to them going. Yeah. The magic of friendship. But what happened to Tira? <laughs> and it just shows him like... <laughs> oh, look at these jerks. Oh. But yeah, I, I know that the third game has the extra capabilities, which I really enjoyed. Yeah. Um, now, granted, granted... Because I give you those extra abilities, yeah. you have to use them perfect. It's not like it's not like you're just playing through this and you have mm -hmm. magic powers suddenly. Hot cocoa? I'm sorry. Hot cocoa? Hot cocoa? Oh. These guys knew what was gonna happen to their characters. <sighs> no bandicoots were harmed in the creation of this game. We could have played as her. Yeah, we could have. Here you go. I even have the beach scene. Huh? Let it guess go back to Neocortex? I guess the beach scene is if you did not collect any of the other crystals. That that was going to be your ending of the video game. 
So which I, is why so 100%ing back. the video game is the only way that you can actually get the good ending, like the, the, okay. the true ending of the video. So, so, so I have to go back into that. Yeah. <clears throat> so, but before I do, I might do the time trial? Or do you want the, the ending? What do you want first? Either way, Let's, my question is, well, do we just extra content this? I don't know, because I don't know how long it's going to take. Me neither. Um, yeah, let's cut here. We'll do the time trial, and then we'll go b beat up the other guy. All right, guys. So. We're going to do just that. We'll be back for one more round, hopefully. <laughs> <laughs>